Hi guys, it's Joshy here, and I'm here to show you how to get three and four star photos of Eldegoss in the new Pokemon Snap. Now, if you do have other ways that I'm not showing at the moment, let us know in the comments. I may know about them, I may not, but there are multiple ways for most Pokemon to get these interactions. But what I'm going to show you is the easiest. Also, please do note, you do actually need the Ruins in Auras to be at level 3 or higher to be able to get our 4-star interaction. But for all the others, any level's fine. So to level it up, just go through the level, play it properly, trying to get as many photos of as many Pokemon with different interactions and submit any new ones. You'll level it up pretty fast. And when I say new ones, I don't just mean new Pokemon, I also mean new star levels. But anyway... So you can get a one star here easy, but the way to get your three and, uh, well, three stars anyway, you actually got to get a photo with multiple floating Elder Goss, and you need to have the main subject affected by the Illumina effect. Now that's that one. To get our four star, you actually have to throw a fluff fruit up near this cliff edge here. What that's going to do is it's going to knock down this Natu, which doesn't show up on the scans, I'll, you know, say again, which is a pain. And then you need to just watch this Natu, who this Houndoom is blocking. And if anything, you can lure it over with a Fluff Fruit if you need to. You need it to get close to Eldegoss. Now, you can't do it with Houndoom, you need to do it with Natu. And then Eldegoss and I really hope I got the Elder Goss there, is going to use the Cotton Spores when Natu gets close. Doing so gives you your four star, so I'll see if I get a photo of it, or if Houndoom blocked it. It better not have. Good to see you. No, we did get it. So as you can see, we only got one until Houndoom stepped in front, but that's it using its Cotton Spores there on the Natu, and then our three stars are there. I did get some ones here, so obviously... They're not good enough, apparently. But it's your three star when they're affected by that Illumin effect. Usually from that flower, I just throw it up there, that bloom. But that will get you your three star. I found my three star. I got best, I think, at level two while they all float down over your head. But as I said, you can do it at all of them. Also, as I said, the four, you have to knock that Natu. It is a little difficult because of the fact that the scan does not show that Natu there. But once you know, you can just copy what I did and get it there. So I'm just going to let the professor pick some photos and I'm going to send them in. So anyway, guys, if you did like this and it was helpful, a thumbs up is always great. But at linked at the end of the video will be a playlist with Pokemon from this game and how to do these. If there is a Pokemon I haven't done yet, as I'm planning on doing all Pokemon, let me know and I can get onto it sooner or I can point it out to you if I have done it and for some idiot reason didn't put in the playlist, which wouldn't surprise me with me. Also, you can check out your... Uh, not your, my YouTube channel. And if you want, there is a lot of different playthroughs there and different videos, both Pokemon and non-Pokemon related. And doing both as well, I do on Twitch, which is linked down below. And that's a great place if you like being part of a community that's fun. There's different stuff there. But anyway, guys, until my next video, I'll see ya.